Oh my goodness. That's amazing. Hey, what's up? I am super excited about this paddle. This is one of the very first ideas I had when I started thinking about paddles. Uh, I think one of the first steps when I started thinking, you know, obviously thought about the basic wood paddle, but then I thought, I've got to make one out of clear acrylic. Uh, and if I can make the whole paddle completely clear, that would just be the most amazing thing. The only downside is it actually took me a long time to get this piece of acrylic because it kind of came into high demand with all the uh, coronavirus crap. Uh, but I was finally able to get a piece of acrylic. So it's just under a quarter inch thick. So I think that'll be perfect for the blade thickness. Now doing the rubber on this is a little bit tricky because you want it to be clear. So I've done in the past, I've used this uh, shelf liner stuff that's kind of clear. It's just a little bit cloudy. So what I ended up doing is getting a roll of clear silicone sheet. So it's silicone rubber sheet and it's like 16th of an inch thick and it is like crystal clear. Uh, the only downside is you can't really stick silicone to anything because glue just doesn't work with it. Uh, so what I'm thinking actually is if I can get the shape of the paddle and get this rubber cut out that when I pull the backing off of it, it's got kind of a, a semi-stiff backing on it. When I pull that off, it's got a little bit of a static cling to it. So I'm thinking I might be able to just do this onto the acrylic with some static cling. If not, I might have to use some super glue, which it doesn't stick great, but it does stick enough to be able to play a little bit. So we'll have to see. Uh, I'm also gonna use this for connecting the pieces of the handle, and I'm hoping I can sand this all down and try to get this thing, at least the blade and the handle, as crystal clear as possible. Uh, anyway, this is gonna be quite the experiment. I uh, hope you enjoy this. Let's go do it.
Andy. Oh my goodness, that's amazing, that's unreal. Alright, so here's the test to see if I can get this to stick on just with kind of a static stick on. So, not using any adhesive first. It's got, so one side has a thin backer, the other side has a thick backer. So, I think I'm going to pull off the thin side first. Just get that off. And then pull off the thick side and see if I can get this to stick down. Oh, here goes nothing. Already getting debris on it, but that's actually staying on there pretty nice. It's got some bubbles in it, but it's staying on there. That's really cool. All right, I'm gonna do the other side. You know, there's bubbles, but I really don't think that's going to make a difference. <laughs> that's awesome. Look at that. It's complete now. A clear ping pong paddle. And this silicone is really clear. I'm, so, I'm really impressed with that. That was, ended up being a good purchase. I was kind of worried about how clear that might be, or might not be for that matter. But this is amazing. Now we got to test it out. Works. That's decent spin wise. I suck. The paddle's good. It's heavy. I know that much. <laughs> All right. So check this out, the clear ping pong paddle. You can barely even see it. I gotta catch the light just right. So using the uh, the silicone sheet, and once I peeled that backing off, the static is holding it on, and it's holding on great. I mean, it you could peel it off pretty easily if you wanted to, but it's not falling off. You know, there's no issues there. You know, obviously it captures some air air bubbles in there, but I even tried hitting the ball directly on the air bubbles and it doesn't dampen it at all or anything. But you know, it works. It puts, the silicone is pretty grippy. So it actually puts a surprising amount of spin on it. Uh, and there it goes. 
But this turned out great. Uh, the downside is my shop is so dusty and the static on this thing that it's already getting kind of cloudy. Uh, so I don't know how well you can see that, but it's getting kind of cloudy because there's so much dust on it. But really, I mean, I'm thrilled with how the super glue worked here. Most of the handle is just completely crystal clear. Uh, and really, this battle is just awesome. Anyway, leave it in the comments below if you have an idea for a ping pong paddle I should make. Other than that, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.